How's it going everybody? It's Pride here and welcome back to another PvP video on Dark Souls 3. So today I got another episode of Weapons You Never See in PvP. I don't got a name for it. That kind of rhymes, so that's that's not a bad name. Today I have the Valor Heart. Man, when is the last time you saw this shit in PvP? I remember it was all the buzz before the DLC itself came out. You know, Ash's very Andal. And it was fun for a little while, but then you realize that the short range of the weapon itself was not really worth it. You know, the damage output wasn't the greatest. It does have a couple cool things that it can do. For example, it can have a nice long leap. Lunge. I said lunge. You can guard break people. And overall, it's got some nice little looking combos. So that is what I'm going to be using today. Probably going to be summoning some people, putting my sign back down. Should be an overall alright time, as long as I don't get destroyed. Here are my stats, pretty much just focusing on kind of like a dex strength build. It's overall pretty even, D, C. It's about as good as it's gonna get with 400 AR, which is not bad for a straight sword, it's alright. Oh yeah, and you can't buff this weapon either, which is kind of a bummer. This man, he, he hit me with that? using the superior version of what this weapon is, which is a straight sword. Now, that's one of the things that it also does have, you know, you can block along with hitting people, which, I mean, it's not the greatest, especially since you do lose a lot of stamina because it is blocking. You know, it's not the best, but... Ah, should have done that. I think the little lion also does some damage, right? If I'm not mistaken. I fucked up everywhere there. Jesus. Alright, what does my man have here? <laughs> what? Yeah, don't ever do the lunge. Let me go ahead and put that out there. The lunge is not worth it. There we go. GG, my man. Like I said in the beginning, it does have a nice little lunge, but you never, ever, 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 uh, ever want to do that thing. It has probably the worst tracking of anything in the universe. But that jumping attack, man, it's nice to chase people down. If you get hit in midair, you're going to block the hit. It has its moments, but definitely not all the time. You know, it's one place where I think this weapon wouldn't be too bad if you use it like very, very, very early on. Where you'll get people who are actually using shields a lot who maybe are newer to the game and don't really know about guard breaking, and then, you know, you just BAM, instant guard break with, with the weapon art. That's probably where it would work out fairly okay. Damn bastard, don't edge me. Bit too far. Bit too far for that that lunge. Let's see. I'm probably gonna try to do a lot of, a lot of different moves rather than your regular roll. R1 spam, which would probably be the best way to use this weapon, to be honest. Just like a regular straight sword. Ignore all the other moves. You know the weapon art? You know the lunge? Ignore them all. Spam R1. Uh. Why? What <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> what a weird wave. Uh-oh. Did he say goodbye? Was he saying goodbye to his good connection? Goodbye, steady connection. Here comes the lag. Oops, meant to do a jumping attack there. The Achilles lunge. Ah, don't follow my own moves, huh? Or excuse me, my own rules. Damn, headset's about to turn off. By the way, again, the Claymore. <laughs> like, last time we saw so many people using the damn Claymore. It's insane. That weapon is used so much. Obviously, because it's insane. It's an insane weapon. The Claymore is just, like... It's good on every build. It's the Lothric Knight Straight Sword of Great Swords. But so is the Lothric Knight Straight Sword. It could be used as a Great Sword, an Ultra Great Sword, a Dagger. I would consider it to be in that Lothric Knight Straight Sword League. Uh, the same guy that summoned me the first time. That's usually why I don't really like putting my summoning signs back down. A lot of times you definitely see uh, the same people summoning you over and over and over sometimes. Lost your night straight sword, man. 
Lock the Nitrate Sword, Claymore. Lock the Nitrate Sword again. The next time is probably going to be another Claymore. Oh, wait. I wanted to use this. There you go. I almost forgot. I need it. With this weapon. Maybe don't jump right in there. That would have probably been a good tip. Let's see. If we go right from the... F Oops. Wait. Oh, shit. I have the wrong thing out. <laughs> I'm all red, so when I saw the shield, I'm like, oh, that's my shield. It's red the way it's supposed to be. Damn it. I didn't think he was going to do that. Or else I would have just R1 spammed. Busted all my stamina. Run. Let's see. Which is the hit that does the shield block? I think is the, the second hit. The one that actually hits with the shield. God damn it. I thought I would have gotten away from that. He's got some perks on him. Don't do that to me. Oh! Okay. See what I mean when I said that that weapon can work as a ultra great sword, a dagger, a straight sword? Don't worry, next episode of uh, Weapons You Never See in PvP. Lots of nice straight. Hey, who do we got? Great Lance. You think he's gonna be using that shield or he's using it for maybe the, the weapon art? Yeah. I'm in a kick at all. Hmm, if he's gonna do that, then I can actually maybe shield break him. Gotta be careful for that thing's true combo. That, uh, that Great Lance true combo. 15 hundo damage sometimes? That ridiculous fucking weapon. Ah, oh, the fucking first hit would have gotten him. That would have been sick. Ah! Hmm. How much range does a little lion have? Let me test out a little bit of range action. That's not that bad. Obviously, from there, it's not going to hit him. Lion range! Get in that lion range. Yeah! That's the lion range right there. Good game. I feel like sometimes you could consider that uh, Great Lance as a weapon you never really see in PvP, but I think it's kind of grown a little bit in popularity. I feel like people have realized that it's actually not that bad, especially in duels. I would say it's around mid-tier, not high-tier, and it's definitely not trash. Any weapon that has some ridiculous true combo does not belong in that, that trash category. Down there with your candles and your Lothric Knight straights. I love you, Shrek. Sometimes you get funny people that you get punched up with. You see the, the phantom in the back fall down on his back, though? It's pretty funny. I maybe don't want to do anything like that on, uh, in this, against this guy. I don't know if it's better to delay that, but then it's one of those things where immediately all they have to do is roll forward, and you're kind of screwed. Ah, if it was a little bit closer. There we go. Good game! I love you, Shrek. <gasps> and there he is, Shrek! You don't love Shrek enough if you don't get a tattoo of his anus right on your forehead. I always wonder with weapons that Toilet Rat 2647291, nobody ever really uses. I wonder if there's some hidden combos that people just have no idea about that are just, you know, like insane troop combos or something. Maybe even like infinite combos. All right, who's fighting? Get in here. Oh my God, Lothar of Nice is gonna fuck me up. All right, lots of nitrate sword, or is that the regular long sword? Hello. Uh, no, that is the lots of nitrate sword. I guess in what world would you ever use the regular ass long sword over the lots of nitrate sword? Mm. 
Ah, right, my man. Actually, I think the rolling attack of this thing has, uh... Oh, I meant to do the jumping attack. Sometimes it doesn't come out. Right. I think the rolling attack has a uh, block. If I remember correctly. Don't you even try it. Fuck it! Yep, yeah, never do that. I'm done trying that. I'm done. I tried giving it the benefit of the doubt. Maybe it'll work this time. It didn't. It didn't and I'm done with it. Gained his HP back already. He already gained it back. Ooh, that was close. That was so close. Good game. You fucker. Now I gotta use another damn Estus. Do you want to die, toilet rat? Fucking toilet rat, dude. Jesus Christ. Alright, toilet rat. What the hell was that? Go. The parry fake out. I thought he was gonna summon somebody. What was that that he used? Why is he healing? There he goes. I ain't healing. I ain't fucking healing. Damn toilet rat. Don't offend rats like that. Okay. I'm out. See ya. Nope. I can't get out! Fuck! I hate this game! Are on chicken. I never see so trash player. Most garbage in this game. Alright, I think it's time I summon people myself a little bit more. Damn it. Alright, how about I just go fucking play Fortnite then, Miyazaki? If that's what you want. Come on! <laughs> and that is every single person that is on Dark Souls 3. Oh, a new one. Alright, at least I think this one will work. Weapon that I've never seen before. Oh, is that? Yep, that's a Claymore. Is a Claymore going to overtake the... Uh Lothic Knight Trade Sword? Ah, damn it. I hope that I held that long enough. And that as well. Damn it. Damn it. Lion Chan! Got him. GG. Claymore man. Hey, now that I said uh, Chan, I can put a hardcore uh, tentacle monster uh, straddling a young- Why is there a little one hidden over here? What the hell is this? Old fire hand. Alright, I'm gonna summon old fire hand. He's hidden away over there like a creep. I found your sign. Let's do it. Come on! You walking or what? I'm a lion, your ass. Lion? Give him a bite. There he goes. All right, on to the next one. I don't know what was going on there. Let's go ahead and just summon another. You know what? Let's not summon the ones that are hidden in the corner. Like a goddamn weirdo. About time. Took this half a monster an hour to get over here. Dragon power X. I don't know why the X is needed. All right, how much is he gonna be using that weapon art? If he uses it a fair amount, I'm not gonna be able to get close to him. The false sense of... Ooh, that was a lucky backstep on him. Mm, didn't work out in my favor there. Don't get too close to him. 
I thought I was gonna keep uh blocking. He might do it because he knows that this thing can guard break people. Just fucking taunting me. I think he still came out on top of that trade. Ah! I baited his bait. I don't like the sound of that. Damn it, I, thought, I was certain that I was gonna hit him. I at least catch him at the end of his foot. What if I just go towards him jumping? Whoops, I'm trying to do the damn jump attack. Here I come. Here, ah. Of course. Thanks for ruining him, Miyazaki. Maybe shield? Lion for last hit? Oh, never mind. A weird ass hit there. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I don't know how that hit him. But I'll take it. Alright. I think that's a good one to end it on. Damn Havel monster coming out. This is a good looking weapon, man. I can't really think of many weapons that look as nice as this one does you know there are some really cool looking weapons you know but the design of this thing with a little lion on there the design on the weapon itself with the gold it's stylish it's a stylish weapon but it gets outclassed by damn near every straight sword that exists i don't know many good situations where trading with a shield like that would actually help especially with something so low in damage because the trade-off is almost always never going to be worth it, especially if you're trading with something like a greatsword. Greatsword is almost always going to win. It's going to, you know, do stamina damage that might fucking get you reposted, like you saw in a couple of those uh, instances. I think the point of the series, not a lot of people understand. I know that there's weapons that are better. A lot of people in the comment section of the first video were saying, why would you use this when there's weapons that are so much better? Because no one uses them, and I want it to. That is the point of the series. Not that they're the best, but it's just, you don't really see them. Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you made it this far, a like is very much appreciated. Is that a trap, by the way? Hope you guys have a good day, and I'll talk to you all later. Peace, everybody.